Um, let's talk about a software that helps you document your electronics. Um, and this is like fritzing. And I saw some information somewhere that right now you may be able to do some simulations. Uh, if I can verify that information, then I will do another tutorial on that. But for now, I just want to show you the fundamentals of using fritzing for documenting your, pro your electronic projects. And for this one, I will do just a simple Arduino blink exercise. Um, so when you go to your fritzing software, it's actually free, so you download. I've already done that. so I, I I believe, I believe you know how to download uh, the software. So it's in my download. Uh, since I'm, I'm on Ubuntu, I am using the shell to start the software. So I will start the terminal and then everything products. Okay, real quick. Um, so that this tutorial doesn't come when it's on and on and it's off. So we would spar it directly. So we'll one so it will be in the document folder, so you come to your folders in your file, let's do this, my computer is uh, a bit slow, for reasons I don't understand, honestly. Um, oh. So you're going to save this in your, in your folder, um, and then when you come to look for it, let's see and verify whether we will find it, and if you find it, that would be awesome, that would be marvelous. Um, and with my work done. So basically, if you've been looking through instructables, um, Arduino forums and everything, um, you definitely see circuits of this kind and, and you're wondering how they manage to do this with Arduino bus functionality. So basically, free thing I've made work much easier that I don't have to create a physical, uh, I don't have to create a physical site.